see the right day. There's my pigeon there. There's the other baby pigeon. Mummy pigeon was 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 here um, about an hour ago. Bringing some food, no doubt. That's how they that's how they feed birds. That's how they feed their little uh, babies. Oh, that's a beautiful pigeon. It's going to be probably a few weeks until they fly. Wow. Anyway. <clears throat> Better not disturb them. Yeah, my cats. Imagine. Yeah, they, they know there's some pigeons out there. Yeah, I'm only standing at the door and you're meowing. Well, you want some wet food? Can I have some biscuit water? Want some wet food? Look at that, it's a messy kitty. Don't know what the temperature is in here, but... Um, don't know what the temperature is in here, because I'm uh, playing a... Uh, Playing that moon full Atmos movie, um, so the whole system's on. Well, almost, almost all of it is on. A um, few amps are off, but flipping that heat in there, flipping that. Oh, if I put the thermostat in there, the uh, oh, I wonder what the temperature would be. So I've got the air conditioning on here. I've uh, got the room temperature down to twenty six point seven. In the bedroom as it was uh, with the little mini uh, 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 air cooling thing I think it was only down to 27 point point something oh, I'll put the thermostat there come in here in a moment uh, I'll give it about 10 minutes or so and I'll see what the temperature goes up to it's 26.8 at the moment that's gone up 26 it's gone up one point It's gone up another point, 20 point, uh, point 0.8. Uh, it's gone up point 0.9. It's gone up to 27. Meow. 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 It's up to 27 now. It's got to be at least maybe, I'm thinking maybe it's about 29, maybe 30 in the kitchen. Yeah, it's very slow, you know, watch, you know, do the video of this and then pause in video and then resume, so it's going to have another point. So it'll take, take uh, several minutes until it gets a temperature gauge reading. But that was like watching paint dry, so I prefer it in here. So I know it's about 26, I know it's about 26, so with the air conditioning turn off for about, maybe about five uh, six, six or seven minutes, then it gets up near to about 29, 29C. The other day it was up to, I think it was about 30. Unbearable. Oi! Oi! Now stop it, bear. Bear, stop it. Get out. Go on, out. You're not doing this shit. Out. You're not doing any of that shit. Up there, bear. Come on. Bear. You're not doing any of that shit, so calm down. Calm down, bear. Uh, Twenty-seven point eight, so it's getting up to twenty. It's getting close to twenty. So it's twenty. Flipping that. Twenty-nine. Flipping that. Unbearable. This. This. 
you know, all this system's got cooling fans on it, but still puts heat out. 28 Celsius in there, flipping that. He knows. certain surround balance I would put on this movie with the side surrounds and back surround otherwise certain parts of the um, that SRB separation on the boosters which is up on height height one or mostly it's sounding it's mostly sounding on dog number one which is there you know, left and it's right as you know and like stereo mixing and such and the width of uh, the amount of stereo width they've applied on the front uh to that sort of sound effect um as well as uh, occasionally on height number two maybe a little bit now and then i don't know why the mostly the the panning of the music uh, as such is but in the height number three and a little bit in height number two up makes no point because it sounds like the rest of the music score that's playing over the rest of the basically the rest of the channels there's nothing instrumentally different about the um the music score it's, it's not like it's got a different you know musical note like maybe a a, a, a harm maybe a harp sound or such or a different you know a different musical element because you know if anyone done has done mixing using um any sort of mixing program on a computer and you assemble all your um musical instruments into tracks or stem or uh so you've got inf well almost infamous well not really infamous you've got bundles of track levels you can add uh, you can have it have have this track play mono, this one play stereo, put a little panning in it, uh, EQ, trim, balancing, all that sort of bloody nonsense, all that rubbish nonsense. I've done that at college years ago. But when I had, you know, such poor sound mixes in movies that are like this, that cost bloody hell millions, bloody hell millions, would last you a lifetime, the money, that sort of money. And... I'm hearing a really rubbish overhead surround mix. It's not exactly um nah, it's not even it's not even there, you know. It's just like near, you know. Um you know, so if I get the other channels hear the music up there and that was the SLB up at the front like you know and then it kind of pans through the um, overheads um, as well as I can feel it in the floor a little bit because of the reverberation 
and this is a concrete floor <laughs> um, but this part here is um, this part here this is just made of um, oh, I think it's uh, foam and plywood and a bit of that plastic uh, metal thin film stuff it, it, it's lo it goes on roofs what, what's on there it goes on roofs um, for installation and such but yeah I can feel the, I can feel the reverberation big deal 